from Dear Portugal Gang to the Vime. This is how to get rich quickly just by putting videos up on YouTube. Let's check it out. He's good, he's good. He's good, he's good. Wicked. It's Portuguese good. All right. Before we get started, I noticed that many of you who watch my content still haven't gotten around to subscribing. It costs you nothing to subscribe, but it really, really helps me out. So go ahead and smash that subscribe button. Go on, smash it. And if you don't... That's ignorant. All right, let's get into it. Okay, how can we make a lot of money on YouTube and become rich really, really quickly? Well, I'm going to tell you the secret by telling you what not to do. <laughs> All right, let's get started. So number one, the first thing you shouldn't do. Well, the first thing you shouldn't do before you even get started is spend loads of money on equipment, on equipment that's unnecessary, let's say. <laughs> so for example, you shouldn't go out and buy a MacBook Pro for two and a half thousand euros. Definitely don't do that. Um, everybody knows that uh, it's prob probably more important to have uh, good audio than good video. Despite that, you probably shouldn't go out and spend uh, three or four hundred euro on uh, top of the line DJI Bluetooth audio. <laughs> Don't do that. Uh, what else shouldn't you do? Oh, you probably shouldn't go out and spend uh, over 500 euro on a uh, 360 camera. Definitely don't do that. And then don't spend another uh, eight or 900 euro on a drone. <laughs> Definitely don't do that. And then probably don't spend another five or 600 euro uh, on peripheral equipment uh, to make all of those things play well together. Yeah. Oh, and uh, don't spend another 200 euro on uh, software for video editing. Definitely don't do that. Did I say 200? I think I spent uh, another 100 on Rico. Oh, did I say me? Am I talking about me? Well, hypothetically, hypothetically, don't spend all, all that money on that sort of equipment. Yeah. <laughs> what are some other things? What are some other things uh, that we can do to get rich quickly on YouTube? Oh, I know. Pick a niche, guys. Everybody knows that you should pick a niche. What that means is you should pick one thing, one topic, uh, and not just in, not just, it's not just about picking one topic, it's about picking a topic that you know many, many people will be interested in. Many, many people will be interested in. So whatever you do, guys, don't just uh, put up random videos. So for example, don't put up videos about, uh, don't put up videos about places where you've gone traveling, um, don't put up videos about um, how to get things done. Like don't put up random how-to videos. Uh, don't put up videos about things that people won't be interested in. Like videos about boring topics. Hey, look, this is the uh, sewage processing plant near where I live. Isn't that interesting? Look at that. They've actually got a sign over there, believe it or not. Uh, warning about swimming in here. So whatever you do, don't go swimming in there. And if someone does go swimming in there and gets into trouble, there is this uh, life life preserver. What would you call that? Life rescue ring or whatever it is that you can chuck out to uh, rescue them. Just in case someone does decide to go for a swim in the uh, sewage treatment plant near my house. Anyway, where was I? Yeah, no sort of random content and definitely no political content. So definitely don't make uh, videos about Shager, for example. And uh, definitely don't make videos about veganism. Who would do that? Such a divisive topic. Who, who would put such a video up? So no random comments. Niche down, guys. And then you can make a lot of money off YouTube the way I do. <laughs> what else can we do to make money on, uh, to make money on YouTube? So yeah. Oh, definitely um, uh, become a YouTuber in a relatively small country and uh, make all of your videos 
in English instead of the local language. Yeah, definitely don't do that. Definitely don't do that, yeah. Definitely don't move to a, a country with a small population and then make videos in English instead of the local language. Who would do such a thing? Definitely don't do that. Yeah, what else? Ah, yes. Definitely, listen, when people go to uh, watch a video on YouTube, they go there to see the, uh, the content. They don't go to see you do introductions or have an introductory jingle. Uh, so definitely don't do that. Definitely don't have a long-winded introduction. <laughs> and uh, definitely, definitely uh, don't have a, a theme song or something like that. People just want your content, guys. So don't do that. Oh, and definitely, definitely don't ask people to subscribe uh, before you've even before you've even given them anything. People don't want to subscribe to your channel before you get, who would do that? Who would ask people to subscribe before you've even got into the content of the video? Who would do such a thing? Tell you what guys, lovely day again, Sunday afternoon and uh, beautiful blue sky. Quite a pleasant 30 degrees today, so I'm getting the last of my steps and I've already done, I've already done about 25,000 steps, but I'm just getting a few more in. Yeah, because I had a, uh, a bowl of muesli with soy milk earlier, about 400 calories right there. So I'm just out here burning that off. Oh yeah, definitely don't interrupt your videos with just random, just random stuff, just talking randomly. Everyone knows that you're just trying to make the video pad out so that it gets over the eight minute mark so that you can uh, have mid-roll adverts. Everybody knows what you're doing. So definitely don't just go on random tangents just to spread your video out to eight minutes, guys. Definitely don't do that. Everybody knows what you're doing. Who would do such a thing? Not me, honestly. And then the last thing, guys, the last thing I want to say, definitely don't watch a video uh, about how to make money on YouTube from a YouTuber who hasn't even got 4,000 subscribers, guys, and uh, who is uh, making videos in a country that's got a very low RPM, which is how much money he makes per thousand videos, which for me is uh, three euros per thousand views. I get three euros, roughly speaking, for every thousand views. So definitely don't listen <laughs> to a YouTuber who's only got 3,800 and odd subscribers and only has an RPM of three euros per thousand views. It doesn't make any sense, guys. And on that note, <laughs> I think I'm going to wrap the video up here. I know, uh, oh yeah, and definitely, I already said that was the last one, but I really do have one last one. This is very important. Definitely don't take advice from anyone who uh, uses clickbaity clickbaity titles for their videos, uh, like I just have. <laughs> and uh, is probably going to get at least half a dozen unsubscribes just from this video. Definitely don't do that. That's definitely not a good way to make a lot of money on YouTube. Anyway, it looks like I'm about to get eaten by a uh, Sarah Dare Strella dog. So I think on that note, I'm going to wrap the video up here. <laughs> if you like this type of content for some reason and you're new around here, please consider subscribing. And if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. Muito obrigado, amigos. Ciao.